What the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail, the Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. Has it been yet? Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. No, oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> No, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Here are the photos. My uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Uh, well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. Uh, all the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options. I'm showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. Now, there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. That means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSPD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. 
The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't... Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Harris! <laughs> good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If you're happy, I'll start making the arrangements. Great. I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you. What the fuck? Disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just... I want you to do something besides sit there eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. <sighs> Fuck me. A bike ride along the Spucci Beach? Okay, Dad. I got just the thing to show you. <sighs> Looks like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford, so the thugs break in our house. 
Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck! Ah! Dad, wait! <laughs> you. I, I'm a dancer. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man, Jane. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Plus, we're take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you gotta kill her pad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? Hey, Let's go. Those walls could talk. You think I do it? Hey! No! Hey! Shit, hey, Daddy. cool, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, hey! Oh, oh, gosh, man! I like that! What's the problem? You're such a jerk! Come on! Dad, you dumbass, these guys are serious! Yeah, well, so am I. Talk to the scene of my fucking boat! Oh, motherfucker! Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! You! You fucking asshole! Listen, he, he's the fucking asshole, okay? He smashed my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes and he just went. I'm getting a cab. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life. 